Uh, there we go. Okay. So welcome to my uh, YouTube channel and my blog, trainingblind.wordpress.com. Today I'm going to demonstrate pull-ups again, but this time I'm doing, instead of underhanded ones like this, I'm going to be doing overhanded ones like this. Now, I've done something interesting. I don't have chalk. So I didn't want to go out and spend the money on getting chalk from my hands. So what I did was I put baking soda on my hands, and when you do that, you just want to get right into the webbing here in your fingers. Can you show them that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see okay, that. Okay, so the webbing, you want to get in there. All right? Now, what it's going to do is give you a much better grip on the bar. Your hands aren't going to slip as much. In fact, they won't really slip at all. All right? So pull-ups, you're going to be exercising your lats, your back, your shoulders, your deltoids here, um, your biceps a little bit. But your, your back and your lats and your shoulders are really going to take a hit. And of course your grip. Now, I'm well over 300 pounds, so this is just to show you that even if you are heavier, that you can actually do this. Alright? And Jared's going to give feedback. I want you to tell them if, you, if, uh, if my, because uh, there's blind people that are listening or watching. Yeah. And I want you to just tell if my range of motion looks better than the last time you saw it. Okay? Absolutely. So I'm going to try for five. I'll see what I can do. I'm, we're both a little bit tired today. <laughs> so here we go. I'm going to try for maybe uh, a couple sets of five just to show you how to, or uh, maybe a set of five. I'll see. Okay, ready? Ready, Jer? Yeah, yeah, here we go. <sighs> Better range right. of motion? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, your range of motion okay. is getting better there. Now, here's what's going to happen. He's going to follow me around, and I'm going to show you how to rest. All right? All you want to do is just don't get my mess, okay? <laughs> Keep my mess out of this. Okay? Yep. So all you want to do is you want to walk around, right? Swing your arms around a little bit, okay? I'm going to get me a drink. It's necessary. I drink coffee during my workouts because I find that the stimulant caffeine is very useful. So we walk, we swing our arms. You know what I'm wondering if I should just show, uh, what do you think? Should I show the uh, weighted vest work? The, the, uh, Negative chance with a weighted vest? Sure, why not? Yeah. You could do them when with the I'll vest them, or without them. it. Or? No, no, I'll do them. I'll do that on a separate video. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to show you what you can do if you start to get to failure, and you have a pull-up bar like mine, or you have a door-mounted one. I love this one because it's it's seven feet, and I'm six foot one and a bit, so I have a teensy bit of a bend in my elbows. Right? How many minutes are we in that video? Three minutes and twenty seconds. Okay, so I'll do one more set, then you're gonna, and then we'll stop it. Okay. All right. Sounds I'm gonna, good. I'm gonna try to show you what it's like when you when you actually can't when you are getting close to failure, and you want to still complete it because you want to build muscle. So I've got the bar, probably about shoulder width apart. Okay. Right, so now I can't say I can't do anymore. You jump up and do a negative, and you jump up again and do a negative. Okay, nice. so that's pull ups. What do you think? That was great. Okay, so uh, we'll just stop that now. Thanks All for right. watching, and I hope this helps. And uh, have yourselves a wonderful day.